It was a family emergency playing out in their own driveway. A mother and her two young children inside this SUV when it caught fire. It was just billowing with smoke. It was, it was wild. I mean, yeah, we were really concerned it was going to catch the entire house on fire at one point. A driveway danger caught on camera, and you'll see it only on two tonight. Yeah, that Friendswood family can barely believe what happened. First came the smoke, and then, within seconds, the SUV was engulfed in flames. The mother acted quickly and got her children to safety. And then neighbors, seeing all of this, rushed in to help. That family talking only to our Roseanne Aragon tonight. She's live in that Friendswood neighborhood with the latest. Roseanne? You can still see the burn marks on the garage there on the gutters and this right here is actually a piece of that car which sat right here which is now a bed of ashes. This family says they are lucky that they escaped in time. Yeah, I was just baffled. I mean, I can't believe that it happened. Sunday afternoon started out just like any other. David Cox's wife had just gotten home. My wife backed in. Um, she went and got a car wash and she went and got gas and then she noticed that the car was smoking, so immediately she got the kids out of the car as fast as she could. First their four-year-old son, and then their four-month-old daughter. And then she came and got me, frantically screaming, David, the car is smoking. Not a minute later, he says this happened. Their 2017 Acura MDX burst into flames. Basically, it was just a huge cloud of smoke covering the entire street. Uh, the whole street smelled like burnt plastic. As firefighters worked on this. Concerned about my kids' safety and my wife's safety. Neighbors took the children away, but Cox, even today. Here it is. Um, it's pretty unrecognizable as a car. Can't help but wonder. There was no warning sign. There was no service now. There was no um, anything. We've never had an issue with the car. It was just completely spontaneous. He said they had just bought the car in February, and there were no recalls. It got rubber on the garage, um, the discoloration, and it got rubber on the house. The fire also cracked his window. Oh, driver's side is melted off completely. And his other car. It's total. But these images are enough. The child passenger seats are right there, and then my daughter's was over there. To have him counting his blessings. Extremely lucky. It could have been much worse. I mean, it could have been 20 minutes down the road. Everything that, you know, got damaged has insurance, and everything that, you know, is not replaceable is fine. Lucky, lucky guy. He tells me he is thankful that none of his family members were hurt. And he says since he only had the car for less than a year, this will all be covered. Reporting live from Friendswood, Roseanne Aragon, KPRC, Channel 2 News. Ooh,